All right, here we are in part 11. This is the final part of Toonstruck. Oh my goodness. Will Drew uh, save his friends and escape back to the real world? Possibly. Tune in right now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, so with our handy glasses in tow. Up we go. Mm-hmm. As you might imagine, we're uh, going to be employing the Medusa principle here. Oh yeah, if you can't see it, it doesn't hurt you. Well, if you if you got a reflective thing. Oh. Let's just uh, scope out this door, actually. I can't believe mm -hmm. that just went right past my head. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Oh. I guess that wasn't an authorized hand. Yeah. So that's that's why we haven't really approached that door. Gotcha. That was a little painful, it seems. But, uh, alright, let's suit up. Ooh! Oh, they're mirrored shades. Yeah. I understand now. Those don't look mirrored. Hmm. Oh. Ladies! <laughs> oh my gosh. Come here often? I'll be in my bunk. <laughs> oh. She's into it! Oh, wow. <laughs> Hmm. Hmm. Oh no! Oh, <laughs> Jesus! Coolest Jesus. dude in the room. That was kind of creepy. Oh. 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 She done hypnotized herself. Oh jeez. Well. Hello. Anybody home? Here, yeah, kitty. Oh come on, Drew. Yes, master. Master? Did you call me Master? Yes, Master. This isn't one of your tricks, is it? I have no tricks, Master. Only my boundless dedication to you. I only want to be of use to you, Master. Huh. Now, this should be interesting. All right. So let's... Yes, Master? There's somewhere I want oh. I'd go to the ends of the world for you, my master. Actually, the hallway outside will be fine. Hmm. The reasonable tyrant. Yeah. So as you can imagine, here's the final bit of the prophecy fulfilled. Good. And I didn't specify it, but the whole uh, turkey dynamite, that was fulfilling the whole uh, dead bird rising from the ashes oh, thing. Oh, that makes... Ah, uh, funny. <laughs> okay. You really want to help me out? Stick one of your paws at that scanner. What a neat solution. <laughs> it doesn't, like, seeing the future is not really helpful when you only see vagaries. Yeah. I don't really mean that. Now, scat. Scat? Scat. As in, get lost. The last thing I need is some sleepwalking. Don't be mean. <laughs> lost. Yes, master. Then again, I really would be crazy not to take it. Oh, come on, Drew. Don't worry, Drew, Drew's a nice guy. He's not going to make it too weird. Just a little weird. <laughs> but that, oh, come on. Itch in places you can never quite reach. Itch like an alley cat, as you wish, master. Well, you see your pal Nefarious, right? Well, hopefully she'll figure out she needs to unhypnotize herself. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I guess I wonder. No insult is too ugly or too crude. Ugly and crude. Yes, master. As for myself. I mean, she hasn't really done anything that bad to you. Well, I mean, she was working for an Yeah, I guess you're right. I guess you're right. I love what you've done with your hair. You catch on fast. Bye-bye, sweetheart. Have fun. Poor misfortune. All right, well, off we go. Mm. Oh. Lots of fun things in this room. Oh, yeah. I'm a fan. It says, power offline. Oh, you can still see misfortune in the background. Oh, yeah. There's, There's a little, little detail. Hey, I told yeah. you to get lost. <clears throat> You're disobeying me. The power's off. Oh. Mm hmm. Yeah, so there's two puzzles in this room here. Okie dokie. Well, let's turn it on. Yeah. Let's see what we can do. This thing won't budge. Oh, no. 
We really need to demand our money back from that gym. <laughs> Power seems to be off. There we go. Hmm, I wonder what could fit here. It's a complete mystery. A niche. Niche, damn it. Gosh darn it. Speak like a Frenchman. Hmm. I mean, we... Way. Whatever. Alright, so... We gotta test out our crystals in each of these slots. Okay. Ah! Oh, we found a winner. The old brute force it. Yep. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're terrible at this. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> there. I, oh. I did. I got that one in one go. Yeah. It's easy when two of the <laughs> options are blocked off. Yeah, it's a 50 50 shot. Yeah. You're a genius. Hello, power! I mean, you're assuming that's gonna give you power. Maybe it just punches you in the face. <laughs> oh. Bingo! Eureka! Etc. Mmm. So here's the warp device. Good! That'll take us back to the human world. That's pretty hopefully. exciting. Yeah. You know, more and more, I'm starting to see where Flux came from. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you can, you can see that in Drew a bit. Hmm. Alright, so this puzzle here, we've got these four uh, levers on, and... Ah, each one, maybe? Yeah, they yeah. kind of correspond to different things. Okie doke. Um, I just want to point out here, mm -hmm. you're going to see me flip, flip these switches in a specific order. Okay. This is following the Toonstruck official hints and solutions. Oh. Um, so, if you notice, the force field is still activated. What? And here's, yeah, it's still... Oh my gosh, Toonstruck, the, god, the guide lied to you! This, I know, this stupid guide. Oh my god. What the hell? Who proofread this shit? <sighs> it was me. <gasps> Yeah. Oh my god. Now you know my sordid past. I... <laughs> but there we go. It's easy enough to deactivate it. Well, that's good at least. Yeah. Alright. Now let's go for a joyride. Uh, yeah! We did it! Do we have the keys? <gasps> Where we're going, we don't need keys. Oh. <laughs> I just gotta, gotta get in real careful here. Gotta gracefully clamber over this stupid... Ship. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> Not necessary. I have seen it's a good thing he has his flying chair, otherwise you'd just get in here and there'd be nothing. Oh yeah. I expected more from you, Nefarious. <laughs> so great. Oh. Answer me this. Why would you want to embark on little outing when I can simply send you back to your own world. No deal! I've heard enough! But Mr. Blank, I'm only looking out for your best interests. Remember your unfortunate little run-in with my syringe? The clock is ticking. This may be your last chance. I don't need your help, Nefarious! I've already found your warp device, and now I'm gonna throw you right out of the skies! Go! I... Look, if I'm a tune, I don't have to meet deadlines. It's fine. <laughs> Yeah, this is actually pretty great. Yeah. Somewhere over the Malevolence. Mm. Come on, you damn machine! Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. It's kind of adorable when it just bobs like yeah, that. Yeah, it's really cute. Do, do, do. It's like a little Jetsons car. <laughs> oh, he's got a flying chair oh, too! Wow. Okay, blow everyone up. Oh, he's gonna. Jeez. <laughs> I was joking. Just need more blood. Oh no! Oh, Fox, little buddy, hold on. <laughs> why did I forgot? Why did King Hugh go after? Is it because he's bad at his job? <laughs> <laughs> Try trying to get the the cuter fire back. Oh, I see. Well, no matter what form he's in, Flux is not to be trusted with no. anything. Forgive me, Flux. 
this is the only way. They'll die together. What? What? Oh, I'm vomiting to my dad. Oh, come on, you big sissy. No two never died from a little old fall. Although, I guess that doesn't help you much. <laughs> Jerk. No, it's fine. I've got toon juice in me or something. Any minute now, I'm going to turn into a tomb. Even if the fall doesn't kill me, I'll be trapped here forever. Drew, you're doomed. Listen, I do have one hope. Ah, I stole this swamp device. Let me explain it to you <laughs> in Just laborious it. detail. <laughs> it's a good thing they're apparently like a billion skillion miles. Yeah. If all I mean is this cartoon logic, I guess. Yeah, it's... It's a trans-dimensional communication device. You know, so we can keep it... I just happened to have it on my person. Oh, that w that was convenient. I had a blast. Is he even holding? It? I don't think he even had anything in his hands. Oh, no, jeez. Either they forgot to draw it, or <laughs> well, if you'll notice, he is faced away from the camera, Wee. so there was no lip syncing. Oh yeah, actually. Yeah, that was a handy handy trick for saving on animation. Fluffy Bun Bun Show needs is Flux Wildly. Yes! This is gonna be a heck of a show. Mm-hmm. Well, well, Blank. You're early. What happened to you? Pulled it all night, Mr. Schmaltz. Hmm. Well, do me a favor. Lose the stubble. Now, let me see those rabbits. Actually, sir, what I'm about to show you... <laughs> Bunnies. Better than bunnies? Mm -hmm. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> talking about Flux Wildly! Flux what? Wildly, sir. Flux Wildly. This little guy is just the revitalizing shot in the arm you yourself suggested the Fluffy Show needs. Although I think Flux would probably describe it more as a kick up the old wazoo. See, sir, Flux is wacky. He's sarcastic. He's playful. He'll be the lord of Fluffy's Hardy, the Costello to Fluffy's Abbott, the yin of Fluffy's Yang. <laughs> Fox and Fluffy, Laurel and Hardy, yin and yang. <laughs> yang, blank. I've been patient with your little lapses, but this, this is inexcusable. Are you single-handedly trying to destroy everything Fluffy has built for us over the last ten years? Well, are you? No, 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 no. <laughs> then I suggest you do what I told you to do. Produce the biggest bushy-tailed batch of cute, cuddly bunnies ever rendered by first thing tomorrow morning. Or else you'll find that it will be you who gets the kick of the old wazoo. Thank you, so <laughs> Oh, so sad. I tried. I really tried. I wish there was some way I could make it up to you. <gasps> we had some money in the CGI budget. Yeah, apparently. <laughs> Fox! Drew, we're in deep doo-doo! We are? The various and Fluffy! They're still alive! You gotta help us! I'll do it! But wait, wait, wait! How will I get there? Well, thanks to Nefarious' mutagen ink, that's not gonna be a problem. It isn't? A 
Oh, 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 no. oh. Whoa. We <laughs> just fucking disappeared. Oh now. my gosh. We did it. Hooray. <laughs> I kind of guessed the ending, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, you kind of... Well, I just mean if you're a tune, you don't have to worry about deadlines. Yeah, I kind of... But, I mean, did you... <laughs> did, did you did you think that there'd be a big sequel hook like that, or...? Uh, no. Yeah. I didn't. <laughs> oh, God. So, and it didn't get a sequel. No, uh, it did not. Um... <laughs> We'll, we'll probably talk more about that in the bonus footage, but no, there was no sequel for Toonstruck. Um, there's been talks about them wanting to try and do, like, a, an HD remake, sort of like the Day of the Tentacle thing. Oh, okay. Um, but last I heard, that was still kind of in a development hell sort of deal. Uh. Um, I don't know. There was, I think it's both, like, a copyright thing slash, you know, the funding for it. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that was Toonstruck. Uh, what did you think of it? I liked it. Yeah. It was charming. Yeah. You know, I mean, there there were some parts where it was maybe not the best game design. Yeah. But also definitely a little dated, too. There's some parts that reek of the 90s. Oh, and... yeah. Oh, yeah. For sure. Yeah. But overall, it was, you know, it was fun. It, I really liked hearing all the voice actors. Um, yeah, you know, they, they knew where to go to the experts for it. Yeah. And I think we talked about it before, but it adds a lot more legitimacy when they're using the familiar voices. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And Christopher Lloyd was a delight. Oh, definitely. I, I, I uh, actually, this, so the viewers aren't going to know this or get a hint of this, but we, we've been recording this one kind of in the background for a while now. Mm-hmm. Um, well, I mean, you kind of get a hint of it, I guess, because David Ogden Stiers died while we were recording this, and that oh. happened months back. But um, during the, the recording of this LP, I actually got to meet Christopher Lloyd at Aww. a convention. Um, I don't have, like, an awesome story to tell, like my Patrick Warburton one. Um, I basically, I just, I went up to him, and I, I mentioned to him that uh, I, you know, I, I'm playing Toonstruck re lately i don't know if you remember working on that and he just kind of just sort of looked at me and he just said oh you're watching that are you uh, oh <laughs> and then I, <laughs> then I wasn't sure what to say oh oh no um but he was he was a very nice man um very it's funny because he is like kind of very quiet in real life when he's such a bombastic character in a lot of uh yeah a lot of his movies but no very nice man i was very excited to get to meet him and get his autograph. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. I like that, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, I will say one thing about Toonstruck that I wish that they did is, um, I wish that they played more with different styles of animation. Mm -hmm. They kind of did, like, they sort of tried to do something, but it's only, like, here are the cute characters, here are evil characters, and wacky characters. Yeah. I kind of wish that they did something more, like, doing different eras. Oh, that would have been cute. Like like a retro era. Yeah, like, like a Steamboat Willie, Felix the Cat kind of era. Or you could have like a oh. UPA animation era. Where like, maybe puzzles are dealing with like the perspective. Um, because UPA animation has that very graphic, flat perspective style. Yeah. Or like something like Hanna-Barbera with the, um... Yeah. That kind of, you know, like they're... Th what about like Filmation? Like, just oh, film yeah. yeah, yeah, filmation maybe. I mean, that's kind of <laughs> that's sort of along like the lines of Hanna Barbera, that very, very limited animation. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, I think I, I wish that they would have played with it a bit more. And yeah, I don't know. But but that said, I do I do like Toonstruck. Yeah, it's cute. Yeah, you know, I I don't think that I would play it myself. Yeah, it's, you know, it's not my favorite game, but there's things I like about it. Yeah, it had enough charm to see it through to the end. Yeah, if if there ever comes a day where they do release a Toonstruck 2, I'd probably check it out. Yeah. Yeah. I'd let you check it out. And oh, I'd, I'd, thank you. you. Know, thank I'd, you I'd, I'd, I'd watch it. All right. Yeah, that, that'd be fine. All right. Well, I guess on that note, anything more to say? Nothing. No. That was good. All Wrap right. it up. 
All right, well, thank you guys for sticking with us for this one. We hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you in whatever our next LP turns out to be. Uh, plus the bonus footage, if people oh, are right. interested in that. Yes, thank you. Bonus footage. Yeah. Yay. All right, see you then. See you.